Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everybody. How's it going? Yeah, um, <laughs> uh, I just witnessed uh, this morning and today um, that people's driving skills, oh my gosh, it's, it's horrible. Um, yesterday, I was at a stop, and I, you know, there was a guy right next to me at a stop, you know, it's just basic, you know, routine, so, um, yeah, just annoyed by the situation, where this kid in this motorcycle that decided to go between us, literally between us, and decided to go about 65 miles per hour. I was like, what? What is going on here? I was, I was not happy at all. So I tried to catch up to him and I took his picture. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and also, I looked at him. We were both at a stop. I looked at him, and he, you know, through his helmet, he was looking at me like, what? And I looked at him, and I just did this. You don't do that, ever. What if someone decided to run through that stoplight and hit you, you know? I mean, it's common sense. Don't go until the person in front of you is going. You know, that's just common sense. It's so stupid. You know, it's frustrating. It's, it, uh, it makes me worried about the future of civilization. It really does. Because at this point, everybody relies on a car. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, and I saw him earlier today and he rubbed his engine at me I was like what do you want from me you want me to call the cops on you you want me to get your license plate and have the cops come after you what do you want what do you want so basically I I had enough so um, and also, <laughs> later on this, uh, earlier this morning, uh, you know, our the town that I work in, we have four lanes. Two of them are together, pretty much. So, pretty much, what I what I did was, I I was kind of curious as to what what why everybody was kind of like going all over the place. We're just moving all around strangely until I got up to the situation where this lady <laughs> was going on the wrong side was pretty much on the wrong side of the road going the wrong direction of course you know she's probably like 60 some years old I'm gonna move on with that I'm gonna just you know I'm just gonna take it for what it is you know she's old senile probably senile probably and don't know any better that's I'm just gonna leave it at that but uh, yeah yeah the uh, picture of my thumbnail <laughs> that's her <laughs> so there's that but I mean I mean those are the people that I want to cater to you know, those are the people that I want to change the way they think. It's because they're not only ruining it for themselves, they're, they're making everybody else upset. They're, they're not thinking. They're not paying attention to what they're doing. And my beard is going in call all kinds of directions here. What the heck? Anyways, so yeah, um, 
Pay attention, people. Understand the laws. Understand the rules of the road. Please. Oh my gosh. Please. As I burp. It's, it's not, it's not much to ask for. You know, I mean, it's a privilege to be on the road. Don't let those privileges, uh, privileges, uh, be taken away. You know, it's, it's just common sense. You know, i I understand, you know, it's not a right, it's a privilege to drive. I understand that. And I want to keep my, uh, I want to keep my, my driving record clean as possible. I mean, granted, when I was younger, yeah, I made a lot of mistakes. But you know what? I've learned from it. I've changed my ways. So, I mean, it's, it's not much to ask for people, you know. It is what it is. You break the law, someone catches you doing it. It's... It, it's inevitable. You have to change your ways. You have to. Um, yeah. It's not much to ask for. But, uh, yeah. Yay. Wow, my glasses are weird. Anyways, um... So yeah, that's my rant for the moment. Poor driving skills. Hopefully I am not at their mercy when it comes to a car accident. Um, I fear, I literally fear for my life every time I'm on, every time I'm on a delivery, every time I'm on the road, every time I'm off work and doing other things, you know, I fear for my life. I really do. But it's a risk that I'm going to have to willing to take. It is what it is. Um, but yeah, it's, it's not, it's not hard to figure out. If you're breaking law, you need to own up to it. If you get caught breaking the law, Lord help you. <laughs> that's that's what it is. Um, but don't bring people involved with your recklessness. It's it's just isn't. Uh, it, it it doesn't make you look good, anyways. But. Understand the laws of the road. Understand the laws of the states. Just understand other towns. They're not all gonna. They're not all gonna be the same as yours. So, if you see someone, or if you see everybody, if you're not in town, if you're not from town, if you see anybody that is not from your area and they're all driving differently than you are then you need to change your driving habits so you don't cause an accident yeah yeah it's it's common sense it's that's just basically what it is common sense it's just logic it is what it is. Logic can help everybody. Logic can change your life. Logic may not be the same as everybody else's, but you know what? It At least it got you through life. Your logic is what kept you going your whole life. And people are not using it. There's a lot of strange people out there. A lot of strange people. Um, so, yeah. Pay attention. Use common sense. 
save your life. Save everyone else's too. Alrighty. So, if you like this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to comment on something that I've just talked about, please go ahead and do so. Because I would love to hear what you'd say. And also, if you want to subscribe, please do so. Because I will subscribe to you. Hey everybody, how's it going? Well, I hope you like this video, and if you really wanted to see more, please go ahead and check out this one right here, and this one right here. So go ahead, have whatever you want there, and y'all have a good day. God bless.